Before we start on the S15, let's go see what this mess is all about. Luke? Hey Luke, don't respond to me if you like Mmm! <laughs> nice. Are you waiting for me to say something? Huh? Are you waiting for me to say something? Uh, no. no. Are you talking shit about me? I said something very inappropriate and I'm cutting it out of the vlog. <laughs> um, I am removing all the stuff we don't need out of the harness because it's already gonna be a lot of shit to hide behind the dash, so the less we have, the better. If you guys don't know what's going on, Luke is actually relocating that fuse box because the engine bay is beautiful now and we want the engine bay to look as clean as possible. So what Luke is doing is he's relocating it somewhere in here, I'm assuming, Luke? I'm gonna try, but the fuse box might be too big. Oh, but okay. But all the wiring is just gonna be behind the dash now instead of coming out the side around the whole entire front and then back into the car. Well, we're gonna let Luke do that. Today, we get more mods for the S15. I've been reading your guys' comments and a lot of you guys have been requesting that we throw on some new wheels. The car has coilovers. So, this isn't the Eliminate channel if we're not slamming the cars or at least getting the fitment right. So, that's what we're gonna do. R33 GTR wheels have got to go. Hey, look who's back from getting COVID. How you feel? I didn't get COVID. I still have it. <laughs> <laughs> Chill. I got tested negative today, so. Good job, good job. Keep yeah. that mask on for a few more days, right? Six feet, six feet. I'm fine, I have a mask. Oh yeah, 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 back <laughs> up! <laughs> Thomas actually gave me COVID. So I think we should be fine. Our, our DNA is already linked. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think about the S15? It's clean, I like it. Nice, huh? Have you seen the new mods? No. Check it out, dude! Check it out! Look at the interior, bro! You got, what, the seats? Yup! You got a new dog too? Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, you got cup holders! Yup. Did it come with the car? This car comes with cup holders. Oh, finally. Japanese people drink water in the 90s, huh? <laughs> got, you got lights? Yup. I wouldn't know the difference. I just, because you looked at it. It looks clean, though. It looks good, huh? Yeah, I like it. It looks like that one Dodge car. You know what I'm talking about? The Pontiac. Was that Pontiac? Is it Pontiac? Okay, no. Yeah, yeah, let's not say that. That's an ugly car, and I don't want to compare this car to that. I like these lights. Do they sell LEDs for these or not? It is LEDs. Is it? Yeah. Oh, shit. Ooh. Thanks. Now I need a kit, huh? Yep, I already got that. The kit that I got this car is very, very, very expensive and it's the most expensive. Not even the kit. The bumper alone is worth two BN kits shipped to the US. You said got two BN kits. Nah. nah. I was kidding. I like that one. I saw it already. Yup, it looks clean. good, huh? It's clean, yeah. What was you putting on these? Here, let me put the camera down okay. and I'll show you. All right. Oh, fire. Fire, huh? It doesn't look so good. What's going on, Roy? You want to scratch? <laughs> um, I want to show you guys something that I'm super proud of with the S15. So, I know a lot of you guys have probably never imported a JDM car before. One thing to look out for when purchasing an S15 is the 34 also has the same issue. They actually tend to rust in this area right here along the strut towers, maybe even along the firewall. And this car is literally rust free. Check it out. For the 33s, the 34s, and the S15s, the manufacturers actually put less coating. As you guys know, in Japan, there's a lot of salt. So that's what causes these cars to rust and I just wanted to show you guys that. I know a lot of you guys are interested in importing cars. That's something very important to look out for. Another thing too is it usually rusts within the, uh, the uh, spare tire area of the trunk. There's zero rust on this car. If you guys watch any of Samet's videos, he'll actually show you guys what to look out for and how JDM importers like try to hide and cover the rust as well literally just by painting over it. So do not trust the auction sheets. Have somebody come out there and you know inspect the car for you. But if you're lucky, like me, you'll have yourself a nice clean chassis to work with. All right guys, let's get started. Here is one last look of the S15 like this. All basic. 
Gotta make sure when we slam it, this is not gonna fit no more, cool. <laughs> Since we have to jack up the car anyways to lower the car. Vu, what are we gonna do? We're gonna polish the exhaust. Yep, Vu has some new tools. This exhaust can use a little bit of love. He already went through, he polished it a little bit, but we want this thing a lot cleaner. So, we're gonna pull off the exhaust as well. See if Vu can bring this thing back to life. <laughs> Emmy, we just hit the jackpot, baby. Thomas, you want to tell him? Yeah. Yeah. What did we hit? Well, well, what was the... Tell me off camera. I was just kidding. Thomas doesn't know. <laughs> I just walked away. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Thomas is usually good at just BSing. <laughs> and I caught your ass. But check this out, guys. So the S15 actually came complete with a whole bunch of very expensive arms from Japan. If you guys know anything about S chassis at all, you guys might know about these. Check this out. These are, hold on. Dirty. <laughs> These are IKEA formula arms. Oh, IKEA. Bomb ass food. <laughs> <laughs> and, hi, <laughs> Emmy. How can I help you? You want to tell them? Yeah? Okay, check this out. Watch. Look, literally every arm is from IKEA. IKEA formula. It's. <laughs> is it called. Is it spelled IKEA? No, it's uh, I K E Y A. IKEA? One, two, three, and up front. Oh, look, even the tie rods, even the lower control arm is IKEA formula. Those are expensive, and we've got Cusco front and rear sway bars. Just finished polishing. What do you guys think? This is how it used to look like, and this is the after results. Crazy, huh? Shiny, bro. <laughs> Honestly, I was planning on buying a new exhaust. I don't think I need a new one. <laughs> Ooh. Guys, we got some bad news. Thomas, you want to tell him? The car's not going to go low. <laughs> yeah. It can't go low. It's seized. What we're trying to do is break off the bottom mount and help free the lock. Let's smash it with a hammer, try to break the rust free first. Yeah, you know what I mean? Here, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Idiots. We forget we have a shop and we have real legit tools here. We're not coming to the house It's cool. You're about to use it on the springs. Oh my god. Thomas is over there setting up the tune. Luke's over here being Luke. And now he's DJing. <laughs> Break that shit! Hey look, on the bright side, look, I give you a brand new exhaust. That's not even your exhaust, that's my exhaust. <laughs> <laughs> oh wait, now I mean, oh, see, on the car it's better, brand new. No, we, we just polished it in the today's no, video. No, it's brand new. <laughs> <laughs> Get him the freaking air, dude. Oh, shit. Oh, hell no, I'm stuck away, bro. Oh, it's fucking over, bro. It's over, it's, it's over. Ready. Is that all rust? Okay, look in between. We should pour some Coca-Cola in there. Yep, if you guys didn't know, you might think it's a joke, but Coca-Cola actually can get rid of some rust. Coke Zero, too. Give me the other. <laughs> Why? 
Stupid ass. <laughs> Get him the PB black. <laughs> Back when I was living in the apartments, I bought a set of coilovers for $200. And they were completely seized. And I threw them into a bucket of Coca-Cola for literally an entire week. And it broke free. So if you guys need to unseize anything, throw it in some Coca-Cola. Trust me, it'll work. Oh, yup. Check out all that rust, guys. Ooh. I knew I was strong, but it's the rust holding me back. How much do you need to go down? Uh, the whole thing? Max it out. The whole thing? Yeah, dude, this isn't eliminated if we don't max it out. Yeah. Can you give me the blower? I'm, I'm right here. <laughs> Blow gun. Oh, okay. You should have said that earlier. I'm right here. <laughs> Wait. Let me, let me help you lower it faster. Just do this. <laughs> oh, shit. I'm going past the ground. <laughs> dude. Show the other stuff right my old offenders, right on the stock, man. So it's over? <laughs> <laughs> it's <all> over? <laughs> Bro, they told me four weeks. It says not coming into like March. Oh, That's not work. Maybe February. Well, by then you'll probably get hit three more times. Yeah, so, like, yeah, that's, that's what I'm trying to go for, yeah. <laughs> if you guys subscribe to Sunny's channel, his car gets hit like every week. <laughs> I mean, it's a real bad luck. so sad, man. All right, guys, everything is on. Are you ready? Here it is. The new and improved S15. You know a lot of people dream about having this car. A lot of people just dream about just two wheels itself. Yeah, both. And people dream about having me as a friend. And having son as I'm just sitting there. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I'm a lucky guy, huh? Yeah. Hey, thanks, Sonny. I got you, dude. Always. Look at the car. Look at the car now. Look at it. You regret it, huh? <laughs> what do you, you think? I give, him, I give him five bucks. I own one percent. What the car? Really? Yeah. I'll give you 20 bucks. I own 10%. Uh, where'd you come up with the 10%? You said 5%? And that's an agreement we made. Yeah. Oh, yeah. But you, you, could, you could touch the shit now. <laughs> hey. <laughs> <laughs> nah, I'm just like, Sunny can drive this anytime, but Sunny, what do you think? Dude, I think it's fucking good. Bruh, this will probably be the way that I build it too, you know? It looks good, huh? Probably. Just a tad lower. <laughs> Waiting for the new coilovers to come in, but yo, you know. Yup. So this is, this is the rears all maxed out. Unfortunately, it doesn't go much lower. But let me take you guys to the front. I think the front fitment is like literally almost perfect. Look at that. We maxed out the camber on the coilovers. Dude. The TEs are just so clean and timeless. What do you guys think about the new and improved S15? Let me know down in the comments below. Yeah, 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 yeah. Damn. Damn. Hey, Amy said, watch out, full frame damage. <laughs> JK, JK, JK. <laughs> hey, it's clean, huh? Yeah, dude. Is this the third video? This is literally the third video. No, it was clean the first video, too. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, look, this build is moving fast. Up next is power, don't worry. I already had everything before I even had the car. So, just know, the S15 is gonna continue to transform and what did I say? Look at that. I'm telling you, the taillights complement this color and this height. I don't think the smoked would look as good. If you guys think the S15 looks amazing, help us out. Give this video a thumbs up. In the next vlog, this car is going to transform once again. 
Hope you guys enjoyed today's vlog. If you did, go down, like, comment, subscribe. Peace. Thank <laughs> you.